Hello fellow YouTubers. Today is a very sad day for myself. I have to lay to rest something very important to me and what I've been doing. And it's kind of hard for me to... Uh, it's kind of hard for me to let, let this go. And I ended up finding out that my Joyo wireless system is no longer a joy to use. The batteries and these things, um, I've had these for a couple of years now. They're not wanting to charge anymore. So it's been making it uh, very hard for me to kind of play, practice, whatever when I'm trying to use these because they'll go dead within like a few minutes now. And I guess that the batteries inside of these things are just plain out worn out. And I've been using these um, a lot for practicing and playing around or whatever. And uh, it just seems that the batteries of these um, just don't last long. So I have to lay them to rest. But on a happy note, fellow YouTuber did a review on these and did a pretty good review on them in fact so I ended up picking up a set for myself so what I picked up is the NUX this is the B5RC the 2.4 gigahertz wireless system for guitar and bass which comes with a nice charging system to put both uh, transmitter and receiver on a charging base at the same time to charge them both I had a hell of a time finding these and every place I looked for on eBay uh, every place I looked as far as um, online music stores and stuff either were out of stock of these didn't have them yet um, and didn't know when they were going to get them. So what I ended up doing is I found this on Amazon, as you could tell by the box. So let's open this puppy up and see what's in it. Like I said, this is a pretty cool wireless system here, and it's the Nux B-5RC. Comes with a nice little carrying case, and I want to say that you can remove the charging dock from this case. Now, it is glued inside of here because I've already removed mine, and basically it's pretty simple to do. Let me pop these guys out. Just kind of finagle you know the corners a little bit over here and you're able to basically just pop this puppy out just like that like I said they did put a little bit of glue on the back of this and the front of this case where this opening is is tucked in around this area right over here if you want to put it back in the case very simple to do very simple to tuck this back in not a big deal so if you want to put some double face tape on this and put it on something not a big deal at all now the only thing that is kind of um kind of goofy is you gotta be careful when you open this thing because as soon as you open it up the wires kind of fall out depending on which way you're holding this so i'm gonna go ahead and put this back in and like i said pretty simple to do you could tuck this back in around here not a big deal so what you have here is your transmitter and receiver and like they said in one of the videos that I was watching uh, go ahead and check the battery power and we have full charge so yeah kind of sweet kind of sweet 
and on the back of these they have a receiver connection with the transmitter connection and uh, yeah nice little design the one thing that I like about this as well is okay you have one input here for charging all right what if you don't want to use the base well the nice thing about this is is that you have a USB cable for charging this and I gotta tell you this is nice I wish the Joyo came with something like this for charging two separate connectors one USB plug these puppies in and charge them not a big deal and I wanted to say that maybe this unplugged it and it was a separate USB just for this, uh, the single but no it's two and one and it looks like pretty much a basic cell phone um, it's not the newer version where it's an oval it looks like just the basic cell phone connection that you would use for you know plugging your cell phone into your computer or whatever now another nice thing about this system is when you go into the specs which this is something that caught my eye uh, let's see where we go here all right now here are the specifications of this now it's a 2.4 gigahertz operating frequency not bad 24-bit uh, 44.1 uh, kilohertz audio quality that's a plus low latency signal transmitting less than uh, I want to say it says here five milliseconds well, that's pretty good too frequency response is 20 Hertz to 20 kilohertz that's nice okay uh, total harmonic distortion which means no overall noise is a 0.05 percent that is nice and that's kind of something that you would see on your higher end home audio systems when you look at receivers and stuff uh, or car audio as well um, in auto sleep mode transmit and receive it's a 3.7 volts um, yeah I mean there, there's it's it's a very nice little system and like I said I had a hell of a time trying to track these things down so I can use them for my own personal use now going back to the sad part of this video the Joyos have been good they've worked for a couple of years now sad thing to say is their battery sucks and I'm sure that I could probably replace these batteries with no problem I know I had this one open because I end up modifying it with a wire so I could take this uh, transmitter and put it on my guitar strap be out of the way so I don't have something about this size hanging off the bottom of my guitar and getting in the way of my leg or, or just getting in the way. The nice thing about the NUX system is that, well, you can kind of tuck it in yourself whichever way you want to tuck it in and uh, use it that way. So, like I said, I've had these apart. Uh, the battery is not unpluggable. It is soldered to the board. Um, but I hate to say that these guys are no longer going to be in use and are going to make their way to the garbage can. It was a fun run. I'm going to miss you guys. But I have these to replace them now. All right, you guys take it easy. Have a fun one. And uh, I will catch up with all of you all later. Remember, if it ain't broken, don't tear you. See, I carried it already. What the fuck? That wasn't the ending of this video. The ending of this video is this part of this video that I'm going to put onto the other part of the video. Then this will be the ending of the video. Got that? Anyways, stay tuned because I'm going to have a second unboxing for the year. Uh, something that I already had uh, that I ended up doing a giveaway on. I ended up getting another one. And, uh, man, I got one hell of a deal on this, and uh, I'm glad I grabbed it and got it as soon as I saw it. So, you guys take it easy. Have a good one. Um, I don't know. I, let's see. I already used uh, Don't Lick a Fire Hydrant and, and uh, uh, Conserve water, water Shower with a Friend. Um, let's see. What else? Um, 
remember, folks, don't wear each other's underwear. Pretty good. All right. Take it easy.